How does it work? Just like a natural arm. You think of what you want it to do, and... Yes! <laughs> hey! Hey! What do you think you're doing? This site's been declared a safety hazard. Stop that right now! This is highly sensitive equipment. That's it. I'm calling the mayor's office directly. Peter Parker, how the hell are you? Speak of the devil. Mr. Osborne. Oh, please. How long have we known each other? It's Mr. Mayor. <laughs> it's Norman. Norman! Norman, what do you think you're doing? The grant agreement you signed has strict safety provisions. This isn't your first violation. Those were excused. By me. We should have confiscated this equipment long ago. But... but I've had a breakthrough. <laughs> Thank you for your great service to our country. These folks will escort you to Oscorp Robotics, where you'll receive the latest in prosthetics. No charge. This isn't about safety infractions, is it? I'm trying to help you, Otto. You're free to continue your work in a secure environment at Oscorp. You always were the smartest guy in the room. You haven't changed a bit. Neither of you. Hey, Peter. Harry will be coming back from Europe early next year. Maybe the two of you can start that business you always talked about. This is opportunity knocking. <laughs> easy, easy, easy. They, they, they didn't take everything. Maybe we could start over. Peter, there's no we. Without the grant from the city, I can no longer pay you. I need some time to think. If I were you, I'd look for a new job. I need a favor. My mom's pet project was research stations that could benefit the public. Now, I launched them, but now that I'm away, Oscorp's gonna shut them down unless they prove their value. I was hoping you could watch them. I left details in each one. Thanks, man. As long as they're here, it's like a part of my mom is too well it's not gonna pay the bills but it sounds like it means a lot to him i'll do what i can to help got a couple stations measuring air pollution the idea is to catch the oh what's the word contaminants before they reach toxic levels between you and me i think oscorp wants this to fail because it might show they're polluting the amount of polycyclic hydrocarbons in the air is way too high and rising. If it keeps getting worse, people could die. Herman! Long time no see. Hey, I'm no lawyer, but uh, I'm pretty sure that's a parole violation. Oops, guess we're stuck in here for a while. Wanna play 20 questions? No? How about we thumb rest? Okay, face punch it is. Whoa, your gauntlets are all digital now, aren't they? Have it your way. You wanna fight? Let's fight! Man, can't wait to put you back behind bars so we can talk science. People don't use banks anymore. You're lucky you found actual cash. If you really want to rob banks, try day trading. It's all the rage. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, no! Oh, come on, Herman! Give up now and we can protect you! No way! You ain't see what I see! 
Sorry, Herman. You brought this on yourself. Literally. Man, he was scared and desperate. These demons are everywhere all of a sudden. If they set one toe inside the vault, I'll have your head. Got it, boss. Tripling security. Demons won't touch a thing. Listen up! Demons are making moves on all our caches. Lost two tonight already. Boss may be in lockup, but that don't mean his hardware's up for grabs. Com check, Eagle 2, you up? Eagle 2 reporting in. Eyes up. You know we can't have vigilantes trespassing or doing illegal searches. Yeah, I know. Which is why I brought a warrant. So what do you say we do some perfectly legal searching? I like the sound of that. What's your name? Officer Davis. Call me Jeff. And you are? Uh... uh... <laughs> Just messing with you. My son's a big fan. So, that warrant cover breaking down doors? Not without a lot of extra paperwork. Electric web for the win! A gadget man, huh? You remind me of my son. Started taking apart the TV when he was five. <laughs> now he's unlocking his friend's phones. Sounds like he could teach me a few things. Okay. Nothing illegal in plain sight? Kinda anticlimactic, huh? At first glance. Let's look closer. Looking for something specific? This yard's been here a long time. Bootleggers used to use it back in the day. Gotcha. Thanks. No way I could have unlocked this myself. Hey, I doubt I would have found it without you. Hmm. I got a big fat nothing. Well, there's one secret room that could be more. Notice anything about the floor? Aha. Uh -huh. Two. Three. Well, that isn't spooky at all. Probably an old bootlegger's tunnel. And it looks like no one's cleaned it since Al Capone. Big chunk of concrete in the way. We've now identified the officer as Jefferson Davis. We're being told he has minor injuries and is expected to make a full recovery. 
Excuse me, miss. Are you supposed to be here? More than you. After that auction house thing, the Bugle put me on the city beat, which means I get to focus full time on real stories like this. And the demons. You know the closer you get to them, the more you become a target, right? The closer I get, the better chance we have to stop them. We? Officer Davis, Mary Jane Watson, Daily Bugle. No comment. I don't blame you. But these guys are gonna tell their story with or without you. And they thrive on controversy. So what's your end? I don't have one. I just listen. Okay. Up in. She's good. Sanitation, this is Eddie. Yeah, hi. Uh, I'm trying to track down some items that were accidentally picked up from a dumpster outside my apartment. Dumpster number? Uh, uh, hang on. Uh, 64476. That's room 33. Truck's already left at shift. If your stuff's not there, you're out of luck. Wait, wait, please. This is important. Can you at least tell me where the truck is? Let me check. All right. Looks like it should be at the municipal garage at Bowery and Grand. Got it. Thanks, Eddie. Please be here. Please be here. Yes. Hope it still works. Phew. Looks like everything's here. Hey, look. An old gadget prototype. Looks kind of awesome. Why didn't I ever finish it? I think I can make this work. Got it. Look, it's that guy who can see Spider Man. Uh oh. I can't take this. You can, and you will. I'll pay you back. Soon. Just ask for help next time. Oh, you are so much like Ben. You have to learn to swallow that Parker pride and accept that you're human, like the rest of us. Martin. I'm sorry to interrupt. I just wanted to let you know I'm headed out of town. You're in charge while I'm gone. Well, you can count on me. How long will you be away? Uh, I really don't know. Is everything okay? It's some personal business I've been planning for a while. But please take care of this place. It represents the best part of me. Well, I guess I better get busy. Consolidated shipping. Jeff, I'm here. What do you see? Find the rest. The boss wants them dead. Looks like the demons are moving in on Fisk's territory. You got this? I got this. You got what you came for. You don't need to kill us, too. <laughs> Fisk's territory is ours now. Not today. Hey, Willie. You. Nice jumpsuit. Slimming. Stay out of my business. Wait, the demons. Who's their leader? Keep my men alive and maybe I'll tell you. Again. 
Come on. Masks are so awesome. Where do you get them? Oh, hey, Solomon! Yeah. Cool, thanks. Do they have a website? Uh, yeah. Whoops. Hey, Yuri. I caught the bad guys, but... But what? You might want to bring a ladder. Yo, Miles. Hey, fanboy. I'm late. You coming? Uh, nah, I gotta get to City Hall for my dad's ceremony. All right. Tell your pops I said congrats. There's the stage entrance. And we'll be right out front. <sighs> Sounds like a lot of people out there. You'll be fine, honey. Last time I gave a speech, I was in high school. Miss Steinberg gave me a C minus. Well, if only Miss Steinberg could see you now. Hey, you got this, Dad. I mean, come on, you saved Spider Man. I'm pretty sure that makes you an official superhero. <laughs> a superhero? <laughs> or maybe I'm just a guy who doesn't give up. <laughs> come on, honey. Welcome, everyone. And before I hand it off to Mayor Osborne, I'd just like to say a few words. Our city is so, so? Such exemplary citizens I think this gang war may finally be over. That, like, I would like, to hand like it over, over? To over? I'm, I mean, there's some loose ends still to be tied up, but... Loose ends? Well, a truck pulled away from the scene from a company called Consolidated Shipping. 
Something's not right about it. I just don't know what. Hmm. Well, maybe after this we can grab some coffee. Figure it out together. Yeah. Um... Well, thanks, Jim. Couldn't have said it better myself, but I'll try. We all know that Officer Davis is a hero. But, uh, instead of coffee, maybe we could have dinner instead. I, I could come over, uh, I'll cook. Or we could, you know, meet at a totally neutral location for a completely normal meal cooked by professionals. <laughs> for acts of extraordinary bravery, above and beyond the call of duty, it is my privilege to present Officer Jefferson Davis with a Department Medal of Honor. Home call, sir. Kind of in the middle of something here, Jim. Sounds urgent, sir. Fine. Congratulations, sir. Uh, thank you, Mr. Mayor. I share this honor with my family, my wife, Rio, and my son, Miles. Without their support, I... I couldn't do what I do. Yes, I've worked many years for this moment. Who is this? Over the coming days, your company, your city, and everything you care about will be destroyed. People will beg you for help, but you won't be able to save them. <laughs> Listen, jackass, I get threats like this twice a week. Why don't you grow a pair and tell me what you want? To watch you suffer.
这边没有问题。教练，好像有声音。To leave now. Dad. 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 No! Wake up, Dad. Wake up. <laughs> 